A new step in the Danish oil and gas era in the North Sea is being taken. The Hira field will represent an important boost to the production of oil and gas in the Danish sector and significantly prolong Denmark's status as being self-sufficient in oil and gas. Situated in the central part of the North Sea near the Danish-Norwegian border, the oil and gas reservoir is located at a depth of 5 to 6 kilometers in the subsoil, in a geological layer consisting of sandstone. Due to the depth, the oil and gas deposits are located in an area with higher pressure and temperature than in other Danish fields, and emphasis has been put on well-proven and safe solutions. Dong Energy is the operator of the Hira development. Together with its partner, Bayan Gas, Dong Energy will realize this comprehensive project through detailed preparation and planning using global experts. For several years, Dong Energy's project team has worked closely with the awarded consortium formed by Technip and DSME to design a unique offshore installation with combined accommodation, wellhead module and processing facilities. Based on Technip engineering, DSME in South Korea will construct the 17,000 tons topsides, which will be a central part of the platform. The Hira platform is designed to ensure that the production and processing of oil and gas from the reservoir will be safe and reliable. At the same time, the 7,000 tons jacket is being constructed in Vlissingen near Rotterdam in the Netherlands. In 2014, the jacket will be transported to the Hira field on a dedicated launch barge and installed in the exact position. The offshore installation will be carried out by the heavy lift vessel Hermod. The launch barge will launch the jacket into the sea and the jacket's legs and the buoyancy tanks will be gradually filled with water as the Hermod upends the 7,000 tons jacket and lowers it into its position. The jacket will be secured to the seabed by means of 16 piles, each 56 meters long and the wellhead module will be installed. Shortly after, the jack-up drilling rig Maersk Resolve will start pre-drilling wells before the installation of the top sides. Initially, the reservoir will be produced from a total of five new wells. The expected time for drilling and completing a well is approximately 190 days. In addition to the deep location of the reservoir, dealing with high pressures and temperatures also presents a significant challenge in this project. At the same time, two new pipelines will be installed connecting the Hira field with the existing infrastructure in the Danish sector. Saipem's pipelaying vessel Castoro Sai will place the pipeline on the seabed and afterwards the pipeline will be trenched. In order to install the topsides, a long journey begins from South Korea on a heavy lift transport vessel. Arriving on site, the topsides will be lifted by the heavy lift vessel Tialf. Positioned with anchors deployed on the seabed, the gigantic cranes on Tialf will lift the integrated deck, which is the main part of the topsides, into place on top of the jacket. Tugs will carefully maneuver the heavy lift transport vessel in front of the Tialf. When lifted, the transport vessel will retract and Tialf can start the movement towards the jacket. Slowly, the T-Alf approaches the jacket. On position, T-Alf carefully sets down the 11,000 tons integrated deck in position. 
It will take a few days to secure the top sides to the jacket substructure. In the meantime, t Alf has retracted to its start position and the transport vessel returns with the living quarters. In two separate lifts, the living quarters and flare boom will be lifted carefully into position and fastened. After the installation of the top sides, the final hookup and commissioning of the total facilities will begin. For the first time on the Danish shelf, oil is recovered from a depth of five to six thousand meters. At the same time, the drilling of the remaining wells can continue. Fully developed, Hira is expected to produce 35,000 barrels of oil and 76 million standard cubic feet of gas per day. The total reserves in the Hira field is estimated at 170 million barrels of oil equivalents. The sales gas will be exported via a new 24-kilometer pipeline tied into the existing gas pipeline to Nubro onshore. The live oil will be exported via a 90-kilometer pipeline to the existing Gorm-E platform for further transportation to the oil terminal in Fredericia. In order to be able to handle and process the oil from the Hira field before distribution, the oil terminal will be significantly modified and expanded. During the project lifetime, focus on the environment and safety is paramount. Dong Energy systematically works on reducing the environmental impact of its activities using the best available technology and best environmental practices. Dong Energy's safety policy only allows one way forward, the safe way. When installed, the platform will have a living quarter to accommodate 70 people. During normal production operations, some 25 people are expected to be on board. Dong Energy has chosen to use the port of Esbjerg as offshore base during the operation phase, and the project is expected to generate approximately 500 permanent positions offshore and onshore in Esbjerg, Fredericia, Copenhagen and in the associated supply industry. The Hira field is expected to start production in 2017 and by then it will significantly increase the oil and gas production in the Danish part of the North Sea and expand the infrastructure allowing new fields to be added at a later stage. Further, by going deeper and encountering higher pressures and temperatures than any other project in the Danish sector, it will increase the expertise within the Danish oil and gas industry and the capabilities of executing new projects for both Dong Energy and its partners.